Okay, you guys, getting in the car and I am getting ready to head to Walmart. I am so excited to take you guys along with me and I'm so excited to be partnering with Walmart on this video. I'm going to share with you guys my favorite things for the holidays that are great for gifting and getting your home ready for the holidays all the decor i'm going to take you guys along with me in the store and then i'm also going to show you guys my home and how i decorated everything for the holidays so i'm going to be doing like a little home tour of my rooms that i decorated so far that i can't wait to share with you guys how they all turned out So these sweaters would be like such a cute gift. They feel like barefoot dreams. And I'm loving this like neutral. And these are only $18.98. And they come in a few colors. This burgundy is pretty too. This is from Free Assembly. This is so pretty. I love this color. And it comes in navy. This is like a good everyday basic sweater. This cream cable knit. And it feels really soft too. And I ordered this one online. Oh, this one comes in navy too. This is really cute. These shaker sweaters, I have this in the camel, but here they are in all the other colors. This pink is really pretty too. And these are only $15. So pretty. How pretty is this gift wrap? I love all the neutrals. And this is a really pretty wrap. It has like a little sparkle to it. And then I'm gonna get this one. Okay, these cozy joy spun are really good. And I love this pink plaid. And these are only, you guys, under $10. This looks so cozy. <laughs> This is like a long, I don't even know what you would call this, but this looks like the coziest thing ever. There's only actually like three left, but this is so soft. It feels like you're wearing a blanket. So cute though. Even comes in this like nude pink plaid. The Joy Spun robes, I've shown this one before in the plaid, but they have solids as well, like a velvety material. This like nude blush is pretty the hot pink and then there's even like a gray and then a burgundy and then of course they have the prints over here i've been wanting this air fryer so i'm officially gonna get it especially with the holiday season and it's like the most stunning air fryer that i've ever seen this mixer would be the perfect gift or even to have for the holidays if you do lots of baking um, this is also from the beautiful line and this would also make a good gift for anyone who loves to do lots of cooking and baking and I got the air fryer in the cart okay this I thought would be cute like in my kitchen it's really pretty this was only under right under five dollars thought that was super cute Walmart has some really great blankets this is really cozy from the Better Homes line. This is in the vanilla color. This is really soft. And let me see the price. Oh, this is right under $20. And this beige is pretty too. These are like the Barefoot Dreams blankets for less. And they have them in the new plaid this year. They have a couple colors. I love this beige. I think I'm gonna get this one for my grandmother. These are always like great to have on hand for gifts. You guys, this is my microwave. This is such a good one if you're looking for just one on your countertop and it's white and gold. It comes, I think, in a few other colors, but I love this microwave. This is that wreath I showed you guys if you saw it on my Instagram stories, but it looks so real. It feels like really good quality. I just took off the red bow, but you could, if you are doing red, I think it looks gorgeous, but I just swapped it out for a pink just to match my theme. And I thought this was like a really, really good quality wreath. So if you guys are looking for one, it looks so realistic and it's under 30. You guys, I was here a couple weeks ago, like earlier, and they now are almost sold out of all the My Texas House things. Um, but I think that a lot of them are available online and I'm gonna show you guys what I got last time when I tour my house for you guys later in this video. But these trees they do have, and these are like one of my favorite things that I got. They're stunning. 
And these I also got, but they're so cute. You guys, they have bottle brush trees, like life-size ones. They're like huge. And then these trees look really nice. How cute and darling is this heart cast iron Dutch oven. So cute. And it's also from the beautiful line. This reminds me of my Kendra Scott jewelry box. This looks really pretty. And then there's also this like necklace stand and it even has a little drawer for rings. That would be like a really cute gift. My favorite beanies from Time and True. Now they have like a fair isle, like neutral, pink. They have like this one. This one's really pretty. That one is super cute. And now I'm going to show you guys a little tour of how I decorated for Christmas. All right, so here's an overview. I'm still getting, you know, the room together, but I did the bulk of the decorations that I want to do. There's still quite a few things I'll point out to everything that I want to do. So first up, I have my tree all done. I did a decorate with me over on my IG Reels. Actually, almost everything I got on this tree was from Walmart. Um, these ornaments I got from Walmart, I got two different brands. So one is the holiday time brand and then the other is the My Texas House brand, which you guys know I've been loving the My Texas House brand from Walmart. It is amazing. I've purchased, been a longtime lover of the brand actually because I've been using their rugs for years and I still have them in my home. Actually, this rug right here in my living room is My Texas House. And um, these ornaments are, I think these ones are the My Texas House. There was like a multi-pack. There's like all different kinds and the quality is really nice. And I love that these are shatterproof because I made the mistake last year and I got glass ornaments and I didn't realize it. And then they would just like randomly fall and shatter everywhere. And especially with my nephews and now my niece um, that are gonna be in my home, I didn't want to have any like issues with that. And um, so I wanted the shatterproof, which is really nice. And then there's so like a nice mix of glittery and then metallic, so pretty. And then this beaded garland. So this is one I've had for a couple years, but I all added in this one from the My Texas House brand as well. Everything's on walmart.com. So I will link it all below for you guys. And then I just added some velvet ribbon. Uh, my mom helped me make these bows. And then you could just use some ornament hooks as wire. And then of course some picks and then the tree skirt is from Walmart as well. It is from the My Texas House line. Again, it looks so cozy. It looks kind of like a blanket material. It's really soft and really cute. And then over here on the mantle, I just added, this is my TV up here, but on the mantle so far, I just got this garland. I had this from last year and then I just added some ribbons and then I just um, hooked it on with command hooks here. I do, so this is not totally done yet and I, First of all, I wanna add some lanterns, which I did see some on walmart.com. So I have those in my cart. And so I think I'm gonna add some gold lanterns here. And then I also saw on Walmart, there were some taper candles, like the little taper holders and then candles that I wanna put on the side. These are just for my windows, but I just put them there just to kind of get the vibe to see what I wanted to do. So I wanna do some tapers on each side just to make it a little bit simple. Yeah, let's turn on the fireplace. So that way we could get the vibe. And then over here, actually I have the stocking. This I got from Walmart. I also have pillows on order, but um, they did not come in yet. So I still have to do like blankets and pillows and like a layered look. Okay, it's so bright out right now. So you can't really see the fire. It's just kind of starting. But okay, over here, I just have my sectional here and I'm not gonna show my kitchen today because it is still under construction. There's actually just like one or two more things that I need to do, but I'm just gonna wait for that full reveal in another video. And I didn't even decorate it at all for Christmas. Well, besides like two things in there. So I'm just gonna wait until that is all like done, which should be done soon. But um, I'll do like a full reveal and then like some more decor in there soon. So um, 
I have my record player here. I've been listening to 1989 Taylor's version and this would be like the perfect holiday gift idea since we're like on the topic of gifts in this video. This would make an amazing gift. So I love this Crosley brand record player and then you could get their favorite music, 1989 Taylor's version if they're a Swifty would be perfect. And then I'll take you guys over here. These are just chairs that are actually gonna go in a different room, but I was just, um, they were just getting assembled over here. Okay, so we're over on this console table. So this is a section that um, I just did a little bit different this year. So I found these houses. Actually, I'm gonna turn on the little. So I added these battery operated lights in these little houses. I did like a TikTok and reel on these, but these are so gorgeous. I will have the details below, but they're really, really cute. And I kind of, it's it's better to like style them in like a section, like on a tray or a little pedestal. This is actually like a cake stand that I had. And then you guys, these pearl trees from my Texas house, so cute. Um, I feel like this just is the perfect way to get your home festive for the holidays. If you're having guests over, I feel like it's just such a pretty vibe. And um, these are also Walmart, these stems, so pretty. And then I have another pearl tree here. And then these other ones, I showed you guys these in the store that I had. Um, these are so stunning. And so I'm gonna back up. So here's how it looks. I actually styled this like two other times and I didn't love how it turned out because I wasn't like what I was envisioning in my head, but I finally got it to where I absolutely love it. And I love these lights inside. You just buy these separately and I have like a little remote control for them. So at night, you guys, when these glow, it's so dreamy and pretty, especially at night. It's like not even doing it justice right now. Okay, we have the foyer area. I have this table now. This is a new table, so I wanted to style it new and fresh this year. I think it's turned out so fun. I added some pops of pink in this section. So um, I have some more of the houses with the battery lights inside. And then these are these trees I also showed you guys in store so pretty it has a little bit of glamour i really love that and then i have the i already had these frosted peonies i had these picks from walmart from last year but i saw them at the store today um they still have them so these just added a nice little element of like the pine and then i have this pearl wreath this matches those trees i showed you guys before and then i have my another pop of pink and then two more of those like ribbed looking trees I have a little nutcracker. And then I have that same garland I had on my mantle. I have it on my fireplace. I still have to do the other section of my staircase, but this is what I have going so far. And I think it's turning out pretty good. So that is my foyer section. Another side of my foyer, I have this table. You guys may have seen that in my other house. And then I kind of did it the same way as I did last year. And I just have some candles on here and these stems. And then, and then as we go into this room right here, on the French doors, I just have these wreaths with velvet bows. And then I have my fireplace, which I've had if you've been with on my channel for some years now. I still have to hook this to the side actually. But if you've been on my channel, for a long time, then you know about this fireplace. This is in my very first apartment. And on here, I just did a little mix of everything. This garland I got from Walmart like years ago. It's held up amazing. I saw they also have it this year. And then I just added, sprinkled in some trees I already had. This paint tree I've had for some time. And I finally got around um, to putting it up. And then this just has, I need another command hook to put on the side here for the beaded garland. And on this table right here is where I'm gonna add those chairs you guys saw in my living room. It's like a little front sitting room. And yeah, I really love how simple, but like how pretty it all turned out this room. I was debating if I should put a tree right here, but I'm not sure if I should this year do another tree because I already have one in my um, upstairs and then one on the in the main living room. You guys, I just assembled the tree I showed you guys I got in store and it looks so dreamy and pretty, even better than like the picture on the box. It looks so nice because the quality of this is 
so good. It actually is reminiscent, even though it's not the same brand, uh, but this wreath that I showed you guys with the red bell, this is the pink bell that I added. I just clipped off with wires, it was wire scissors or wire cutters. It was so easy and then just made this pink velvet bell. This I'm gonna put out on my front door, but this feels so realistic and so does this. This like is really, really nice quality. So definitely worth the price. And it has a weighted pot on the bottom. So there's some weight to it and it's not just gonna like tip over super easily. And then the lights on it are like really nice quality. They look so dreamy and soft and very whimsical. So I'm so happy with this. I'm either gonna put this in my foyer or I'm gonna put it on my porch. I'm not sure if you're allowed to do that technically because it's not made for outdoors, but I do have a covered porch, so I'm debating where I'm gonna put it, but this is so stunning, you guys. And the guy was telling me actually when I was looking at it in the store, he was saying how they cannot keep it stocked like for long because it keeps flying off the shelves. They can't keep it in stock. So if you have your eye on it, definitely then don't wait on this one. I'm gonna have it linked below. Um, and then sometimes too, if you see it online, it's available for like curbside pickup from Walmart or you could do a pickup in store and so you could reserve it. So I'll leave it linked below. Okay, and then I also have this that I showed you guys in store, and then I have my air fryer. I'm gonna set that up once my kitchen is all done, which should be very soon, and I'm probably gonna put this in my kitchen, like on a tray, something like that, and I have a few other things. So that was my little Walmart haul. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you guys enjoyed this style video, give it a thumbs up, and I'll have everything that I shared in the description box below. If you're on a mobile device, just tap the title of the video and everything will expand there. And stay tuned for more fun holiday content on my channel. And I will see you all in my next video very soon.